following program is from NET, the Public Television Network. Aquaquado Entertainment presents Quentin's Animation Extravaganza, Episode 9, Mario Party Olympics. to send my manuscript for Chapter 2 of Himitsu Sentai Goranger to Shueisha, the company that publishes Weekly Shonen Jump. Shotaro has already done the illustrations and has sent them to me, along with my script. Attention everyone! The first annual Mario Party Olympics is being held at Animation High School. Come on down to compete, but bear in mind that only four contestants can compete in the final matches. Well, I've gotten pretty athletic due to fighting the Black Cross Army, so I'll sign up to compete. Come on, let's go! Wow, 20 athletes have signed up to compete. Welcome to the preliminaries of the first annual Mario Party Olympics. These matches are to determine which four athletes will compete in the final matches. You will be split into four groups of five. Each group will compete in a series of duels, in other words, one-on-one -on -one matches. Whoever's the last one from their respective group will be a finalist in the main event. Well, I gotta start training. Now then, we are about to determine who will be the finalist from group 1. Will contestants 1 and 2 come into the ring? Number 1? Oh, that's me! Looks like I get my first match right away. Wish me luck! Begin! Ring out! Number 1 wins! Wow! I survived the preliminaries. Didn't think I was going to get through that easily. Well, better start preparing for the main event. Oh, hey, Quentin. So you passed the preliminaries, too? Good for you. Good luck. Oh, no. According to Lori, Lin was very hot-headed when it came to sports. I better do whatever I can to beat Lin. I can't even imagine how Lin would react if she won. Wait, is that? Oh, my God. It's the Nickelodeon Guts theme. Hello everyone, I'm Michael Malley, and welcome to the first annual Mario Party Olympics, brought to you by Mario Brothers Pizza and Pasta. Our four contestants will compete in four outrageous events, and after that, they'll tackle our radical rock, the Aggro Crag, where almost anything can happen. The contestant with the most points is the winner, and they'll get a grand prize of $10,000. Our first event is a 2 versus 2 event, Bobsled Run. Quentin and Lynn will be up against Jerome and Ben. Let's get started. Thank God I'm paired with Lynn. Teams, on your mark. Get set. <coughs> Come on, Lynn. Let's do this. Well, that went surprisingly well. Now hang on. And Quentin and Lynn win. They each win 250 points. Now on to our second event. A 1 versus 3 event. Tug of War. Now let's see which contestant will be up against everyone else. It's Quentin! Looks like I get a chance to dash Infernal Lin. Wish me luck! Players, on your mark! Get set! Pull your crazy power puff! Pull! Oh, Lin falls into the chute! Oh, the other two fall! Quentin wins! He'll be awarded 500 points! Well, we're already halfway to the crag. Now our third event is a four-player event. Bob's away! Will our contestants come to the giant platform in our pool? Oh jeez, bombs away. I can only assume they're gonna throw balls at us until one contestant is left. Wish me luck. Players, on your mark. Get set. Heh, <laughs> Jerome and Ben got soaked. Oh god! 
and Lynn wins! She will be awarded with 250 points! We're now down to our final event, another four-player event, Bumper Balls! I can tell our contestants just got a small surge of adrenaline when I reveal their final event. They know a competition is about to be had! Bumper Balls, huh? Well, I have a strategy to win this one. Hope it works. Players, on your mark, get set! Get wet! Oh, Jerome and Ben are out! Only Quentin and Lynn are left. What's this? Quentin's chasing Lynn to the edge of the platform! And she's out! Quentin wins! Alright everyone, it's now time for the final challenge, the Aggro Crag! Our finalists will climb our radical rock while avoiding all kinds of obstacles. Each player must stay in their own path. Now let's do this! It's time. Who will be the winner of the first annual Mario Party Olympics? Let's find out. Players, on your mark, get set! Charge! And Quentin dashes ahead of everyone, with Lynn closely tailing in. Oh, here come the boulders, toppling everyone except Quentin. He must be no ordinary guy. And he made it! Quentin wins the Agro Crag Challenge! And the first ever winner of the Mario Party Olympics is... Quentin with 1,250 points! It's time to hand out our trophies. There's Ben with the smallest trophy. Drone's getting a bigger trophy. Lynn's trophy is bigger still. And there's Quentin with an absolutely huge trophy! Quentin won! Woo! You the man, Quentin! Well, that concludes the first annual Mario Party Olympics. Thank you all for coming, and we'll see you all next year. Wow, this trophy sure is big. Thank you for supporting and believing in me. I'll be sure to compete again next year. Come back soon, okay? Alright, see you later. This episode was an original story created entirely for this show. Written by Quentin Cole, copyright 2018. This program is a production of Quetzalcoatl Entertainment. This is NET, the public television network.